All right. Guess what? No more buzzing, right? So I turn on the, uh, <clears throat> go down here, uh, and I clicked on that, that and go to uh, Advanced Properties. And then I go ahead and widen it out so I can see everything. And I turn on, oh, now it's showing, oh, because of where I'm at on the desktop. Uh, desktop, not that, Mike Ox 1, I turned on the monitor. It was only showing Mike Ox and Mike Ox 2, and it had a right and a left, yeah, just like it does right now. Oh, okay, and I, and I turned the monitor to monitor and output, the bottom one. I'm not going to do it now. So I could, you know, fiddle with everything, and I, and I finally decided, well, it's got to have something to do with that Acer laptop, and I was thinking, well, all I'm going to do is shut it down. And uh, <clears throat> it's sitting right over there. You can't see it. Well, I'm not going to move the camera right now because it's where I want it. Uh, and then I started, you know, moving it around and looking at it. And then finally I thought, okay, I unplugged the USB earlier, but that didn't help. But I hadn't unplugged the VGA. Instant I unplugged the VGA cable. It quit buzzing. So there's something about, and the other machine, well, you know, that I've never, I, I, once in a while I've had that kind of problem, but I don't remember, you know, having it with that laptop. I probably just didn't ever plug in the VGA cable while I was using OBS, but uh, for the long, longest time I've just left it plugged into. I had to unplug it from Mom's machine down there, the one I'm supposed to put a new motherboard in. I've already, already done it once with that, uh, well, I put a new processor and memory in it with the AS Rock motherboard, which I'd had for several years, but uh, I'd bought it new, you know. But anyway, uh, didn't every it, the Ethernet didn't work, and I had to put a card in it, and I didn't like that because it was only 100 megabits, and we got 200 megabits down, and it has a, a gigabit onboard Ethernet, uh, so the Ethernet wasn't working. And a couple other things, and so anyway, so I bought another a Zeus motherboard. I put it somewhere. You can see it right now, but. Uh, I didn't want to put that in there and basically just rebuild it again. So uh, I'll quit talking and go make sure I'm right.